Joining us now, a man that has excited BYU Sports Nation with the news that he would sign to play football at BYU last Friday, live from Auckland, New Zealand, Manasse Taungafasi joins the show. Manasse, welcome to BYU Sports Nation. Uh, it's a pleasure, mate. It's a pleasure. Did I pronounce right. your last name correctly? Is it Taungafasi? Yeah, definitely, yeah. It's Taungafasi. Okay, okay. okay. We'll, we'll try and perfect that as we move along. It's currently 4.45 in the morning in Auckland. Uh, are you actually awake right now? <laughs> I think so. I'm probably half awake. <laughs> <laughs> Just half awake. Half awake. Very good. Very good. Okay, uh, we have like a million questions for you, but we'll start with uh, some of the simple ones. How did you get interested in college football? Um just been watching a whole heap of it and um, just uh, blessed that I, that I was, um, had the opportunity to um, get looked at from BYU and yeah, that's pretty much how it started and just kind of um, met up with a few people and um, the ball just uh, got rolling from there, mate. Nasi, tell us about BYU and how BYU started recruiting you and uh, your relationships with some of the coaches on the staff. Yeah, it's actually quite funny. Uh, I was um, originally starting on Facebook um, with uh, Coach Kofushi. And um, at, at the time, I was originally um, co committed to uh, Oregon State. And, um, yeah, so it just kind of went from um, social media and, um, I had already uh, I had uh, pushed Steve away and said, "Hey, mate, look here, I'm, I'm, I'm going to join Oregon State." Um, and then uh, yeah, things the the tide changed a bit, and uh, just quite fortunate. And um, when Steve came to New Zealand, uh, I was able to uh, to catch up with him and get a few things sorted. And yeah, I'm a Cougar now, mate. And that is great news for all of BYU Sports Nation. Six seven, three hundred twenty-two pounds, and you—I mean, you came into Studio B. We we met you on your recruiting trip here. You you make us and most everybody look really small. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay with being the big man on campus, literally? Uh, I'm sure there's a few few other big boys around. You know, BYU is never never short of those big fellas. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> Manas it, yeah, Manasse Taungafasi live from Auckland, New Zealand. It is 4.47 in the morning. He is on BYUSN. Uh, we spoke with Garrett Tujay, who is the offensive line coach, and he told us that he's going to do everything in his power and referenced that you are going to do everything you can to be on that plane to Nebraska for game number one. How important is it for you to be in Lincoln, Nebraska for game number one? Okay, it's, it's, it would be the best news possible. Um, uh, we had um, discussed this, and, and um, obviously it's a goal. But, um, that's just it at the moment. Um, I've got this. Like, there's a whole heap of work that needs to be done before um, before I even get on the plane to Nebraska. But um, I'm willing to do uh, all I can to uh, accomplish that goal. But that's just it. It's just a goal at the moment, and uh, Coach TJ is. Uh, um, he kind of he vouched that he'll help me out, and um, just kind of asked for my hundred percent effort, and, uh, and I said I'll be there, mate. When I said Coach Two uh, J said that he sent you over some flashcards. I'm, I'm sure about uh, the game and and just studying and knowledge. How is uh, the studying going for you so far? Definitely um, getting my head around it. Uh, it's different coming from my rugby background. Um, but uh, excited, man. I'm excited. Now, Manasse, you are uh, not a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter day Saints. This is a faith based school with the LDS backdrop. Why did you feel like mm -hmm. you wanted to be at BYU and that you would fit in here? Uh, better than some of the other schools that you were looking at? I just feel some of the values and, um, and obviously the honor code um, at, at BYU um, is uh, uh, 
it's almost values that we already live by here. Um, I'm of uh, Wesley and Methodist. Um, obviously, we have a, a slightly similar other code. Um, and I just thought it's something that I could just come in and slide into um, with uh, no big transition. Um, but coming in from uh, the Wesley Methodist Church on New Zealand, uh, it's very similar, very similar. Manasi, you were playing rugby uh, professionally back home, uh, haven't played football at all. What was your decision on pursuing a new path uh, in, in dropping the game that you played your entire life for a new one? Uh, it was, uh, I was more uh, excited about the opportunity that, that um, playing football helped, um, especially college football a chance to um, get a degree, get a bit of study, and, um, and also pursue, a, a, obviously, um, pursue a, a career in the, in the NFL, possibly one day. But, again, that's just a, that's just a goal. And uh, first, first things first, um, making that plane to uh, plane trip to Nebraska will probably be the biggest goal at the moment. New BYU football signee Manasseh Tungafasi is joining us live on BYU Sports Nation from Auckland, New Zealand. How has the reaction been from your family and friends uh, about your decision to play football at BYU? It's been um, very positive. Um, uh, somewhat, they were shocked because uh, a whole heap of them had to just expect me to join the Oregon State. Um, but they are, it's been very positive, and they all excited, just like I am. I'm excited. I mean, the country's excited. Um, just, yeah, it's just excitement, that like positivity. When I say, are you going to try to play rugby as well? Have you talked to Coach Minhall to see if you can negotiate that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, nah, I think um, well, I'll just concentrate on football and I'll uh, just, just focus on that for now. But uh, I'll definitely be supporting you, mate. Uh, I hate it pretty good uh, for national titles if I'm correct. Yeah, BYU uh, National Championship swagger in rugby for sure. Hoping to get that next level in football, and uh, Manasseh Tungafasi is all in for the football team. Uh, I do want to ask about the reaction you've received from BYU fans uh, on Facebook and Twitter, on, on social media. How has that been for you? Oh, man, it's been pretty cool. Uh, uh, man, I love BYU fans. Uh, it's, it's been awesome. Um, Nothing but uh, uh, positive comments, you know, um, and just wishing me well and um, somewhat. And obviously, there's a bit of, um, I think there, there's a bit of uh, skeptical about uh, the uh, rugby player's transition. But, um, yeah, it's been it's been awesome. Uh, I've enjoyed the journey, and I'm just proud of the Q at the moment. Okay, Manasseh, we appreciate the time. Uh, we <laughs> You should probably go get some sleep right now or something. I don't know what else you're going to be doing it just before 5 a.m. But uh, get some rest. We look forward to having you back on campus uh, here very shortly. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it.